Yo, what is going on guys? This is Raj from OTI Gaming TV and the crew too have done it. I think they've done it. They've killed it. They have brought out the Demolition Derby, which I'm going to talk about a bit later, but mostly what I wanted to talk about was the Bugatti. Yes, I was right. I made a video back before the bear came out that there will be a Bugatti in the crew too. And they put it in guys, the Bugatti Chiron is in the building, it's in the game. And I've seen some gameplay footage from Ubisoft and it looks good, it sounds evil. So not only the Bugatti guys, they've got a Ferrari 812 in there and uh, a Cura NSX. Guys, this game is looking really, 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 really good man. This is, this is, if they add in new cars like this, I can't wait. I'm waiting for more for, from uh, Ubisoft. So you've got a few nice cars that they brought out and the PvP guys, I'm explaining to you about the PvP. So doing you know a bit of research on it, the basic thing about the PvP is everybody's car will be 399. So everybody's car, everyone's gonna be jumping into the PvP with a max out car, and it's literally just gonna be about who has who's the best driver. So there's a positive thing and a negative thing about it. The positive obviously everyone can jump into it and they can prove who's the driver. It's not really about the car no more, it's about the driver. Um, the bad thing is, if those those people that have been grinding, like I know some of my subscribers have been grinding on the game, they're not going to be able to use their parts or the custom parts that they have been grinding to use on online in PvP, which is going to be kind of a bummer because you might have better parts than everybody else that you think that you want to test out, but you're not able to. Um, but yeah, like, but so far, guys, the game good the pvp i think they they took their time to bring it out but i think there's a, it's a good reason the demolition part which i'm showing you right now crazy like this is like basically it's like the battle royale of of cars just smashing everybody to bits you know the, the, the damage on the game is real like i was watching it and it seems like you need your whole a purpose is to smash somebody out like cause as much damage to them as possible without you know without Having yourself get hit too much, and if you if you do start getting weak, you have to basically pre prevent others from really really messing you up. But you do end up spawning in. Like I've seen it when you get knocked out completely, but it'll say somebody destroyed you, where you get to spawn back in. Um, it's it's looking good, guys. I'm not even lying, man. I mean, it's coming out on the December the fifth, which is you know basically tomorrow. Um, the game, I ain't even gonna lie. If they're bringing out big boy cards like this. And the PvP is out as well. I might have to just get it back again. Most of my subscribers know I deleted from Red Dead, but I love cars, and now they, they bought out the Bugatti. My main point was I told you so. PvP mainly main topics is everybody's gonna be having a car that's maxed out. You're not able to use your custom parts. It's just whatever's given to you. Um, but yeah, definitely looking for more uh, forward to whatever the crew has to offer. Good job to Ubisoft. They did good. I ain't gonna lie. Props to you. Gotta get props when they do something good. But yeah, guys, definitely. I'll probably be making more Crew 2 videos. I'm after just get back on the game, guys, you know. But yeah, like, share, comment, subscribe, guys, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace.